Hello everyone, welcome back to Windows Fixer. How's life going? So today we're tackling an issue where the Microsoft Store gets stuck while updating, preventing users from installing or updating any apps. This problem usually happens due to a large cache buildup or internal errors within the store. Luckily, this can often be fixed by clearing the cache and resetting the store's configuration. If that doesn't work, reinstalling the Microsoft Store is another effective method. Let's go through the step-by-step -step solutions. First, try running the Windows Store app Troubleshooter. This built-in tool automatically detects and fixes issues with the Microsoft Store. To do this, open Settings, then go to Update and Security, and select Troubleshoot. Click on Additional Troubleshooters, then find Windows Store apps and run the troubleshooter. Once the scan is complete, check if the store updates properly. If the issue persists, Resetting the Microsoft Store cache might help. Press the Windows key and R together to open the Run dialog box, then type wsreset.exe and press Enter. A command prompt window will appear and close automatically after a few seconds. Once the Microsoft Store reopens, try updating it again. If the problem continues, the Microsoft Store install service might be disabled or not running. To check this, press the Windows key and type services.msc, then press Enter. Find the Microsoft Store install service and double-click it. If it's running, click Restart. If it's disabled, change the startup type to Automatic, then click Start and Apply. This ensures the store can install and update apps properly. If none of these solutions work, reinstalling the Microsoft Store might be necessary. Open PowerShell as an administrator by pressing the Windows key and type PowerShell. Now right-click on it and choose Run as administrator. Now paste the command here. I will provide the command in the description. You can copy it from there. Um, this will uninstall the Microsoft Store. Now to reinstall it, open PowerShell again as an administrator and run the second command. Once the installation is complete, open the Microsoft Store and try updating it again. Hopefully, one of these solutions works for you. If you have any questions or need further help, drop a comment below. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more troubleshooting tips. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.